It might seem crazy, but the little jars decorated with all those squiggly colored lines kind of have something in common with a tasty carnival treat. These were made by a process called core forming that was used before glass blowing was invented to make glass vessels. It's really very simple. Core forming is a lot like making a candied apple. In this case, the candied apple is the core that's usually made of something like clay. And instead of being dipped into hot molten sugar, it's dipped into a pot of molten glass. In the end, after the glass is cooled, the core is picked out, leaving behind the hollow vessel body. It's like picking the apple out and leaving behind the shell of sugar in the shape of an apple. What kind of tool do you think they used to remove the core that was inside the blue and yellow glass jar?